Hey guys, what's up? Dayhan here, and today I'm going to be talking to you guys about the top five dividend stocks that you should own in your portfolio. Now, before we get started, go ahead and click that subscribe button and click that like button, and let's get started. All right, guys, so number five is going to be Union Pacific, ticker symbol UNP. Uh, this rail giant has been paying you know dividends for over 119 years. It has a $3.52 annual um, dividend at a 2.1% yield. It pays at a quarterly rate and their dividend growth head is around like 12% right now and it's been growing. Now, instead of this one, I was actually going to put Ford in, in, you know, in place of this one, but Ford has been going downwards for like a couple years now and it's kind of risky, even though they have a 6.81% dividend yield, which is one of the highest dividends you can find. But I didn't want to put Ford here just because of the risk. Now, if you guys are interested, by the way, in any of these stocks or investing in the stocks and you don't have a brokerage account, I will leave a link in the description to Robinhood. It's a, you know, a link. Basically, if you sign up, you will get a, a free stock, one free share worth uh, $5 to $200. It's random. So if you want to sign up with Robinhood, you know, there's going to be a link in the description or somewhere on the screen. And uh, yeah, so that's number five, Union Pacific. Okay, so number four is going to be BP, ticker symbol obviously is BP. Um, they have an annual dividend of $2.44 at 5.73%. It's a quarterly rate, so this is almost 6% dividend yearly. It's great. Now, one of the reasons I put oil on here is because it's been recovering since 2008, just like the market has. And obviously, oil is something that we need and always will need. Even with all these electrical cars coming out right now, you know, Tesla is trying to change the world. Well, we're still going to need a lot of oil and this is still going to be one of the top market things that we need. You know, even in 10, 15, 20 years from now, oil is always going to be needed. Um, companies are always going to be pumping out the oil and this stock, you know, is doing good just like the market is. And with the demand, you know, a 6% dividend yield, this is one stock that you have to have in your portfolio. All right, guys. So number three on my list is going to be, you guessed it, McDonald's. Uh, ticker symbol MCD. So McDonald has a dividend, uh, annual dividend of four dollars and sixty-four cents at two point fifty-seven percent quarterly rate. So every quarter you're going to get this one. Um, McDonald's has now increased their dividend for forty-two years in a row, which just speaks for itself. You know, McDonald's is killing it with all these new products and items on the menu every you know every year. They have something new or they're trying out some different programs. Uh, McDonald is one of the top food chains and everybody, it, it, fast food is always going to be around. People always want to go eat. You know, it's quick. You just go through a drive through and you're out. McDonald's is just going to keep growing. Uh, I'm sure there's going to be competition there, but nobody's going to take over this. And McDonald's is just going to keep rising. Right now it's uh, trading at around $180 per share, which is amazing. Almost at all time high. You know, this is why McDonald's is a great investment. I mean, 2.57% dividend yield. That's that's pretty much what the banks offer you. Plus, the, the stock, as the stock rises, you know, you earn money on that, too. So this is definitely one of the top. All right, guys. So number two, number two is going to be Home Depot, ticker symbol HD. Uh, they pay out a five dollar and forty four cents annual dividend at two point nine six percent, which is, you know, amazing. That's a quarterly rate. So you get it four times each year. Um, it has been paying this dividend out since 1987. So that's over 30 years right there that it's been paying out these dividends. Um, it has had a 32% dividend growth over the past five years. And just, you know, compared to last year, the dividend has grown $1.32 more annually. It was around like $4 annually last year. So that's right there. That's a huge increase. And, you know, with all your home needs that you can get, you can, you can go and buy anything at Home Depot pretty much that you need for your home. Um, you know, Home Depot is going to be around for a long time. And this is definitely a stock that you want to look into, do some research and see if uh, you want to add it to your portfolio and just let it ride on up and give you that dividend yield. Plus, if, if the stock keeps rising, you know, you're earning that extra percentage on there. But this is almost a 3% return. You know, this is what the banks pretty much average too, except you can, you know, earn more. So yeah, that's number two. All right, guys. So number one on my list, the one you've been waiting for, number one on the list is Coke, ticker symbol KO. It has an annual dividend of $1.60. It pays at 3.5% uh, dividend yield. Um, it pays quarterly. Coca-Cola, you know, they've increased their dividend for 57 years now. Now, just think about that. 57 years is a long time, you know, in a row. So every year, their dividend is going up, up, up. You know, last year it was at 3.3%. Right now it's at 3.5%. Their uh, payout ratio is at around 236%. 
um, you know, they moved into a lot of things. They they do they, they uh, tea, coffees, juice, and even energy drinks now. Like Coke, Coke is spreading its wings and you know getting out into the industry. They're doing a lot, not just Coke. You know, when you think about Coke, you just think about the cans of Coke. But they do a lot more. They do juices, teas, all that stuff. Um, you know, they're diversifying their drink lineup. Coke is a classic drink, and this drink, I feel like, is going to be around for years and years. So even 10 years from now, Coke is going to be an amazing stock to have in your portfolio. I'm sure the only place they have to go is up. So really, you know, at a 3.5% um, return, this stock is definitely one that I will be keeping in my portfolio. And actually, soon I'm going to be um, starting some Robinhood videos. I'm going to have like a video of my portfolio, and maybe you guys can join a journey on that if you guys like it. So go ahead and leave a thumbs up. Make sure you press the subscribe and leave a comment below if you um, have any good dividend stocks that you own in your portfolio. And if you don't have um, a portfolio or a brokerage account, once again, I'm going to leave a link in the description to Robinhood. If you sign up, you get a stock worth uh, $5, $200 for free. So it's free, you know, so if you guys want to join Robinhood, go ahead and I'll see you next time. See you.